Hey everybody, this is Paul. Today I'm going to be showing you how to use the distance formula. So the distance formula tells us the distance between two points on an xy plane. So let's say that we have two points. Let's say the first point is 2, 2, and the second point is negative 2, negative 3. And we want to find the distance between these two points. So to get a visual understanding of this, let's go ahead and graph these. So the point 2, 2 is going to have an x component of 2 and a y component of 2. So for the x component of 2, we start at the origin and move over 1, 2 units in the x direction. And for the y component of 2, we go up from the origin, 1, 2 units in the y direction. And then where these little dotted lines cross right here, we have the point 2, 2. And for our second point, negative 2, negative 3, well, we just go negative 1, negative 2 in the x direction, since negative 2 re refers to the x component, and negative 3 in the y direction, negative 1, negative 2, negative 3 for our y component of negative 3. And where these two dotted lines cross, we have the point negative 2, negative 3. So, by plugging these two points into the distance formula, we're essentially going to find the length of the line that connects the two points, or the line segment that connects the two points. So right now we just have some numbers in here. We don't have any x2, x1s, y2s, or y1s. So we're simply going to label one of these points x1, y1, and the other one x2, y2. And it doesn't matter which you choose to be which. Um, if you plug them into the distance formula, you'll get the same answer. So we're just going to choose the first one to be x1, y1. And the second point we'll call x2, y2. And we simply plug in these numbers where they correspond in the distance formula. So the distance of this red line that I just drew is simply equal to the square root and then we need x2 minus x1. So x2 is equal to negative 2. It corresponds to the left-hand side of this point. So negative 2, and then we're subtracting x1. So we subtract x1 corresponds to the left-hand side of this point, which is a 2. And then that's squared. And then we add that to y2, which is the right-hand side of this point. So that's a negative 3. And we subtract y1, and y1 corresponds to the right-hand side of this point, which is a 2. So the distance between those two points is simply the square root of negative 2 minus 2 squared, and negative 2 take away another 2 squared is negative 4 squared, plus negative 3 minus 2, which is a negative 5 squared, and so now negative 4 squared is the same thing as negative 4 times negative 4, which is 16. And negative 5 squared is the same thing as negative 5 times negative 5, or 25. And 16, time, or 16 plus 25 is 41. So the distance between the point 2, 2 and negative 2, negative 3 is simply square root of 41. So square root of 41 is the length of this line. And that is approximately equal to 6.4. So the distance between these two points is about 6.4. If you want an exact answer, then write it in this form, square root 41. This is the exact distance. This is an approximate distance between the points 2, 2, and negative 2, negative 3. Hopefully you've enjoyed this tutorial, and uh, don't forget to subscribe.